I had a question for Will in terms of limits, right? Because yeah, it's not Good just one. simply, you know, it's simply um, it from what I've heard Will say before, it's not about like just getting a policy, right? Like you can get a policy like, you know, Tommy boy, right? Like a market guarantee, but <laughs> <laughs> you know, or, or you can get real, 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 like strong, uh, something with teeth in it. That's actually going to pay out. Tim, you just like my memes. That's what I'm, I'm yeah. hearing. Yeah. <laughs> I love memes. I love them. Yeah. So uh, we can talk about that real quick. So there's a whole bunch of different types of coverage out there. We just like to say not all coverage is created equal. Um, I mean, you just think about it with anything, right? You have you have experts in certain things. It's it's the same thing as an MSP. You wouldn't expect your client to, I mean, okay, some clients do force the a la carte security thing, but most MSPs say, look, we hate this. The a la carte thing is, is basically saying to the client, oh yeah, you can choose whatever security you want that you think you best need, right? And from the, from the security advisor perspective, mm -hmm. that's clearly not the right approach, right? I mean, that's, they're going to pick the stuff that they've heard of and the stuff that isn't annoying to them. Um, and so it's the same thing with cyber insurance is their, their first thought is when there's an incident, they're coming to their MSP saying, Hey, how fast can you get me back up online? And that's all they're thinking about. What they're not thinking about are things like the ripple effects of lawsuits, breaches, forensics, um, business interruption. I think the average downtime is 14 to 16 days during an incident, yeah. just do all the cleanup that has to happen. Even if you can restore from backups right away, right? There's still yeah. business downtime and there's interruption, uh, reputational harm. There's all these things that kick in that they're not thinking about because they're worried about their computer getting back up online. And that's, they're pushing their MSP, get this back up, get this back up. You're like, I can't, yeah. I can't, I gotta wait. I gotta wait until forensics gets in and does their thing. Or there's, you know, we have to go through our process. Yeah. And so there's a lot of pressure in that situation. So having the right limits on a policy, knowing exactly what you need to have in terms of coverage is really important and making sure it's comprehensive. Yeah. And, and the other piece to that, having dealt with a couple of these incidents in the past is think about the fact if you're servicing any uh, Fortune 500 or 100 com com uh, customers or enterprise for that matter, they're going to come back on you so hard with so many regulatory uh, loopholes you have to jump mm -hmm. through just to start doing business with them again. There's a right. huge cost associated with that as well. So that's something another piece to that fallout that you're talking about. Mm -hmm. That's huge. Mm -hmm.